pretty cool. Um, Shiva says, Carl and chat, hope you are all doing great. Welcome, Shiva. Right back at you. I see a Juz sub. <laughs> uh. We'll try to uh, try to do some three out of ten gameplay. <laughs> Aw, look at all those jazz subs. I have to type quick because I'm gonna lose time if I don't spam. Here we go. This level's cool, I like this level. It's also a little bit tricky at the start. Let's see what we can do. No, I got pushed. <laughs> Shove me around. What the heck? Alright. Getting this Wonder Flower. We can actually go all the way to the left here and get a head start. And this guy won't crush us. Pretty good. Would 3 out of 10 be a step up or down in gameplay quality? Probably a step up today. <laughs> I wanted to get that. Does Ouija do the hat animation if you have the drill and try to go into a pipe? I assume not. Oh no though. Now I want to do a horizontal pipe with Drill Weege. Drill G. And we gotta do some shopping. Oh da da. I love them so much. This game is eye candy. Yeah, it looks so good. Spoonie Bard, I agree. I think that's one of the reasons I've been enjoying speedrunning it. It's just so nice. As far as deserts go in Mario games, this has got to be one of my favorites. I'm not normally like, damn, can't wait to play a desert level, but it's not so bad in this one. So uh, the drill power up lets us go a little faster through the sand. Normally slows you down a bit. Kind of want to dust off your old speed running gloves. Not sure if you have the time though. There's a little bit of a shorter category. A dessert themed desert. How about Mario Kart? Does Mario Kart have dessert themed deserts? Um, wait, what am I doing, Kuroka? <laughs> but yeah. Oh, okay, wait. So for this world, we're gonna start off using, doing the levels that require the, or that like I think are best played with the drill power up. And then, so our mods, um, it's very useful to have the drill, which will make sense here in a second. Love the music. I hide from them. I'm gonna grab this pot here. Use it to hit that guy. Break this watermelon so that it's out of our way. This is a hard part. There we go. And then here's why I want the drill. <laughs> this is why I want the drill. <laughs> All right, we need to not mess up any of our jumps here. Perfect. That is practice paying off right there. Nice stuff. 
Like the entire desert looks like a huge frosted cake. It's somewhat maddening. Oh, Ben Kenobi. Star Wars reference. Hender, I don't get it. And uh, this level that opens up when we beat that level is uh, requires the drill. No. Oh. No. Movement in this level is so hard. Now we're going to do the rest of the stages in this world with the bubble power up. Once we go up here. Oh, this is one of my favorite things. This, <laughs> this makes, this cracks me up when we collect the wonder seed here. Oh, okay, wait, hold on. I want to do crouching high jump here. So we hit this. We have a second to trade in our power up. This part right here is so funny to me. <laughs> Oh, I love that animation. It's so good. <laughs> uh, I love it. All right, we're going to teleport. Do some shopping. Yeah, the seeds are always in the different spot. <laughs> now, I figured out there's actually a way to... Um, we want jet run back on there's actually a way to do this stage by actually jumping in time at the music which is really fun but i haven't like ratted it out yet and you actually um get an extra coin for your trouble nice all right jump underneath that guy collects that coin and that one clean so far Bubble jump here. Bubble jump here. Really good so far. Bubble jump here. Oh, just barely missed it, but still very good. Still very good. All right, one more here. There we go. Good stage. Um, selecting the best badge for each clear. So we're using the uh, jet run badge in almost every stage. To I, it's a very fun speed run. <laughs> but yeah, it is kind of long. Like, okay, so you can, it's about an hour and 30 minutes if you do the glitch category though. So that saves some time. Oh yeah. Mm, now, ooh, this level is very tricky for a variety of reasons. We came up with some good strats last stream though. Let's see if we can do them. It's really fun. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Full jump. Quick jump when we land. Jump over this guy. Hit this guy. Hit this guy. Bubble jump. Oh, beautiful strat. All right. Oops, I forgot to push the button. All right, we have to collect the first star here. And then we're gonna kind of go in a circle around here collecting these. Now we do want to make sure it's faster to bump the wall, but I need to make sure I get some stars too. Oh, not bumping the wall like that. <laughs> no. Dang. So it's faster to like slowly bump the wall here like this. Uh, but I also want these purple coins, so. Suboptimal section there. All right, this is really hard here. We gotta pay attention. Jump, snag that at the last second. Duck jump through there. Oh, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I just don't want to. We came with some new strats there, so I just make sure I don't get hit. I messed it up a little bit, but the good news is, is even if I mess it up, I don't get hit. That's the reason we came out with it. Uh, you can just hold B. Can you seriously? Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, that's gonna make my fingers so much happier. Um, Goombella, thank you for the 20 months. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you for that um, strat. 
My hand is gonna be so much happier not having to spam. Um, we want to switch to parachute for this one. And I have my bubbles, right? Yeah. So the way I like to do it is to bubble up for this one, parachute for these two. And then we're basically ready to snag these last two right here. That was okay. There might be a faster way, but that's pretty good. Balloon G. This is our best world floor by a lot. So that's good. This level's a little tricky. I'm gonna switch back to Jetman. Snoodles. Bubble here. Bubble here. Full jump. Oh. Whoops. Messed that up a little, but we're okay. We're okay. All right, slow mo time, which is mostly pretty easy. Oh gosh. I want to hopefully hit the edge here. If I do, it's all good. Yeah, it is. So then we twirl, and we're good. Nice. Why do we have the flowers in French? Because it's fun. I change the language every time. Alright, and now we go buy our final two seeds from the black market. Love that guy. And that's it for world two. We just have to do the castle. This has some really cool strats. Hopefully I can pull them off. Which I think is the funniest. I've enjoyed German quite a lot. Here we go. We're gonna try Japanese next. World two. Oh, I meant world four. I'm dumb. Bubble here. Perfect. Jump over that. Run down the slope here. Bubble this. Oh, a little slow. It's okay. Bubble here, get a quick jump up there. Pretty good. I'll take it. Good castle. Good palace. Now this boss fight's tricky. Uh, Major too cold. They have the 68 months. One month away from funny number. Nice. We got a good quick hit right there. What do you get when you merge Luigi and YouTube? Screaming. Don't get it. Never get your jokes. I'm sorry. Love all these bubble strats, yeah. As soon as he starts to go down, then we go in for the hit. Right here. Very good. Yo, the little Hylian, thank you for the 84 months. Yeah. Nice, look at that split though. That's a freaking. oh, I pushed the wrong button. That's a split right there. <laughs> Minus four minutes. Imagine we hadn't lost two minutes uh, in 
world too. We'd be at minus six minutes. Oh, I pushed the weird. I pushed the weird button. There we go. It's only minus three minutes. I don't know what I pushed. Scam time. Oh, I gotta spam the thing. Will we be ahead after before? Yes. I need to type slower for these. Will we be ahead after world five? To average segments? Yeah, that's what it was. It's always nice when you lose two minutes and can still gain three minutes. <laughs> yeah, we're going for slime skip. Heck yeah. Slime skip was hard until I realized how it works and that's pretty easy. I was like making up stuff in my head like, oh, if I use D-pad, it like is inconsistent. So I was like switching to joystick. Didn't have anything to do with it. Oh, Zimbo, have you seen the, you've probably seen it. It's not, it's just the, the, the full YOLO jump. In case not, I'll show you. Is there no way to speed up jet run acquisition? Uh, losing two and a half minutes is about the best you can do. Uh, bubble flower all the way from old two palace. Yeah, it's the sad thing is, is about my mount with my route. Like it's GG if you get hit once. <laughs> It's just GG if you get hit once. I gotta learn like drill. If I learn drill backups from everything, uh, maybe that would be smart, but I don't know any. So it's just literally game over for me if I get hit once. Maybe you can do airship first. Oh, really? I didn't know you could do that. See, this is why I need your, I need your routing help because I don't, I don't know how to do, I don't know any backups at all. Yeah, you get the extra bubble there, that's nice. So many clouds. I do you want to get the free coins here? I kind of miss them. There's a purple coin I want to grab there, yeah. I don't think it really matters to get all these, but may as well. Does one give me any? No. Slide. <laughs> Love this remix. Back from 11 ads. I am so sorry. Twitch went so hard. Was it like a year ago or something? So nice. I think there's like a backup fire flower or something here too, randomly. Guess she wouldn't really ever need it. It's not in this round. The downside of doing airship is a bit slower on the world map. Yeah, I mean, right now I lose like a minute. And <laughs> I lose a minute when I lose bubbles, so like, it's got to be better than that, right? <laughs> if it's five or ten seconds, it's fine. Because I just go back and get another bubble, because I just want to learn the bubble strats. Oh, I should have hit this. I don't know if getting this does anything for me. Oh, it does. Kind of worth, I guess. Be a little. Oh, I'm not gonna risk getting those. I think, like, technically, there's a route that just easily snags all these. But it's probably not worth risking it right now. I think my coin count will be good. Oh my god, that scared me. Thought I was gonna miss it.
I like it when it's just the Luigi hat in the cloud. <laughs> Anything to get in these? No. One day I'll remember what's in all these. Oh, I should be going in the pipe, shouldn't I? And I don't have... I have to do a small jump here, I know. Ooh, we almost got hit. <laughs> Whoa, I gotta be careful on that one. Almost burned my hat. How many cells do bacteria have? One. <laughs> so there are different, like, isn't it amoeba are considered a single-celled organism, even though they're like big blobby boys? Um, do I need to go do mama? I don't know. I think I don't. If I remember everything. I need 10 for the bridge and then 100 for the thing. So I think we're good. I like this world. I don't know if it's like people don't like this world or something, but for speedrunning, it's actually really fun. There's another level called Mama Mouthful uh, that you can do to get some extra stuff if you'd like, but I don't think we need it. So that's good. The coin route worked out this time. So Flo, thank you for the two months. Finally be able to watch Lolly without having a fear of getting something spoiled. Oh, did you beat the game? How'd you like it? The final level is lame. You know what? As a speedrunner, I love it. You'll see why if you haven't seen it yet. Uh, it's really epic to speedrun. But I, I hear ya. Like, I would rather that, though. Like, World 3 and World 5, I'm just glad it's not more Bowser Jr., you know? I actually like how it doesn't have a traditional boss. Apparently, fungi is the correct pronunciation. Is it really? But we can... Uh, all languages are living, right? We can change it if we want to. Really liked it. Only the final section of the final level made you rage. <laughs> oh, I'm going to go to Upshroom. This level is very difficult to do optimally. Um, it has two really difficult parts for me personally. We'll see if I can get them here. So we got to do a pretty specific jump pattern here, but then it's okay for a second. So the first part that's hard is this jump right here. Missed it. <laughs> Dang it. Always seem to cut it a little short. But minor time loss. Very good pipe entry right there. One bubble. And then the next hard part for me. One bubble here. Ah, right there. Pretty good though. Much better on the recovery strats this time. And then this final part is rough. Oh, we did it so well. Let's go. Let's see if we can get in the pipe though. Oh, we got in the pipe. Let's go. All right, that level went pretty well. Uh, fuck is this a hard G, it's just English being English to swap it for a soft G in the curl. Latin doesn't even have a soft G. Bye bye. It is. Snivy. Snivy, I think I've been watching some of your runs. Have you been doing oh, runs yeah. of this? I think the name looks familiar. And then next, um, okay, this level has a difficult strat, the way I do it at the start. We'll try our best here. I just need to think about what I need to do. All right, we did it. Nice. It's not hard as long as I remember what I'm actually doing. Very nice. Oh, I forgot you have to jump there. Dang it. So this is, uh, I love this. This is basically like Celeste level two. <laughs> Oh, 
gonna do a sick turnaround here. Oh, that's sick turnaround. Dang, we didn't get the ground pound though. Pretty good. Thematic, this is one of your coolest levels. Yeah, the riffs are sweet, right? I love the riffs. Gooigi. <laughs> I love that, Jerv. Good old Gooigi. Mario did Shadow Clones before Celeste. True in Sunshine, right? How's Jet Run? Is that run faster? Um, it's the fastest one I've seen, Zumbo. I think I timed two of them and they were like identical-ish. So it might not be faster than the one you do. I can't remember. I can tell you later though. Uh, Loki wish the insta damage. Okay, hold on. I gotta do the things and the stuff. Da -da. And then we want to do this one? Yeah, Tumble House. This level can actually be done quite fast with a jet run. So, uh... Didn't get it. No! No! Alright, we just restart. Tricky jump at the start here. Oh, there it is. I, actually, no, that still wasn't it. It can be much smoother. Yeah, all my routes. That, like, that made me jump. I didn't even push that. The inputs in this level are very weird sometimes. I think that blew your mind was finding out that Caesar is actually pronounced closer to Kaiser than it is the Tsar. Uh, wait, what am I doing? I don't even know. Did I miss a level? I think not. Seems if you hold jump through the screen freeze, it'll buffer a jump. Yeah, that's what got me. Ah! I'm stuck in the go, Gooigi. I stole your strat here, Zimbo. It's so good. The Zimbo special. Uh, for the, uh... For the Wonder Seed ac or Wonder Flower acquisition. Oh, or I'm just gonna get stuck. No! <laughs> oh no! He's gonna dodge me, isn't he? Okay, no, he didn't dodge me. Actually, didn't lose much time. It's blob time. Let's go. We're blobbing. Woo! I love the blob. I'm stuck. Oh, dang it. You can make that jump. Oh, we're not blobbing anymore. We're sticking. No, we're sticking on everything. Stop it. <laughs> Clean movement through this section is the dream. Can you touch the flower that says slurp? Oh, is it the one at the very end there? The boss guy? Rewire your brain to say Celtic with a K sound at the start. <laughs> yeah, when I was a kid, I when I was a kid, I pronounced everything so wrong because I used to read a lot, amazingly, and so I wouldn't actually hear the word said. Um, I definitely said Celtic in my my head. I kind of like this level. Do we need a backup bubble? No, we already got one. Nice. Apparently it's fungi. But just, like, when do you get to the point when enough people say it one way that it doesn't matter how it's supposed to be said? Late bubble here, one twirl, second twirl, perfect. Oh. 
Whoops. I can do that a bit better. But that's okay. Alright, this part. <laughs> this part is a nightmare of a jet run. Oh, the background looks cool. I'm like looking at the background. And I shouldn't be. Oh, we almost messed it up. That part is just nerve wracking with jet run for like no reason. Like it's the chillest section without jet run. <laughs> I feel like there must be some way to optimize this part better. But we'll take it. Oh, we'll take it. <laughs> As a Long Islander, I feel called out. Accents are great. I like it when people say things weird. <laughs> so this level is pretty epic. I don't know. If I do everything right. If we die horribly, then I guess it'll be an epic fail. Oh, stay tuned to find out which it is. I have a pretty nice strat at the start here. And we've already missed it. <laughs> Should have bubbled right there. Oh, we almost got hit. Did ev did everything wrong. But that's okay. We'll do some bubble in here. Jet run moments. Ah! <laughs> no. That was fine. Only a couple jet run moments. And now, the blob. You can cut the corners here to save time. Early jump there to save time. And here's the hard part. Here's the blob skip. I think we got it. We took damage, but actually it's fine. We still got it. There we go. Good blob skip. We just can't get hit again. That was fine. We're moving now. We're moving. This part I always mess up though. I don't have a fast way of doing it. Somebody please tell me how to do this ending fast. I'm always afraid. No! <laughs> oh, I always fuck it up. What do I need? I need the one all the way over there. I need this one. YOLO! Yeah, that's the part I need practice on. Always mess it up. Left wall is easier. We'll try left wall. Oof. Oh, looks like we're still in for a fat time save. This is the first bar game without European developer? Who developed this one? What's your favorite badge for casual playthrough? Ah, uh, the parachute was really fun. I really enjoyed how it moved. Yippee! And then there's some actual, uh, whoopsies. There's some speed up strats here. Uh, I think we got it. Oh, did we not get it? Oh, we overshot it, I think. Damn it. You can, um, shoot a bubble and activate this early.
Uh, boosting spin jump is easily the best. Now, yeah, you're you're not wrong. Boosting spin jump is just really good. Grappling vine is so cool too. Yeah, I really enjoyed grappling vine. It's just like awesome. I wish that there was like. I mean, I guess you could do kind of like a fake speed run where you start level one with Grappling Vine on like a completed file already. Um, it's probably some fat time save. Yeah, very nice. But yeah, doing the whole game with Grapple would probably just be really fun. <laughs> I would love to see like a Grapple only speed run. Crash Up is your favorite. Wish it was more useful. I liked it a lot too. Rhythm jump badge and reset every time I lose the combo symbol. I love that. That's such a fun idea. Rhythm jump badge on every level. Yeah, we switch the language every time. It's just for fun. Gonna have to start, gonna make a command for that. Parachute the most. Yeah, parachute is just, it's just really nice. Crypt of the Barrio Dancer. <laughs> I still don't have a really good strat for this level. I remember a bit. Let's see what we can do. I think it's an early bubble jump. Nope. <laughs> it's a regular jump and then a bubble jump. Uh, all right. One bubble here. A couple twirls. One bubble here. And I want to land on the second blocks. Another bubble. Another bubble. Another bubble. And I think we're done. Oh, we're not done. Shit, we're not done. All right, we're good. That was fine. <laughs> that was good enough. Oh, I forgot to practice the next level. I think we can wing it, but... Oh. Enemy bounces count towards the combo, but you can do extra bounces and it won't ruin the combo. Interesting. Um, so I forgot to practice this level, so uh, YOLO. Good so far. Where that guy goes a different way every time. What a schmuck. And now this is the part where I usually mess up. We have a backup bubble, which is nice. Here I have to bubble jump. I don't think ground pounding that does anything, so I probably shouldn't do that. Nice, we got the jump. That jump's tricky. <laughs> How to throw it away for nothing at the end. It does, I think it's fine. We were doing so well. I'll take it. <laughs> Always oh, spaghetti it right at the end there. Oh, do you do um, do you do item park without jet run? I noticed the problem with the way I do it is I end on the wrong pyre up. So I've been thinking about redoing my route. All right, world six. Ah. 
So I always forget where to go in here and how many coins I need. This is like the last part of the run that I need to just kind of route a little better. Like I have the route, but I don't remember the route. Everybody's favorite stage. This is actually a great stage to come to if you ever need power-ups, by the way. Because you can grab the power-ups and then just walk off the left side of it, which I figured out way later than I wish I had. <laughs> uh, okay, I do want to... Let's see how I want to do this. So we're going to start with the elephant. And the way I like to do it... Oh, that was a little high up there. But we got an early cycle on that. No! And it's over. <laughs> Dang it. I actually do want to take damage from that, but I needed one more SWAT first. Alright, I do want to take damage here because it sets my power-ups correctly here. Not that anything matters anymore! No! <laughs> oh! Jet run, please. In jet run moment right there. Holy shit. We just perfectly dodged the thing that we were trying to get. <laughs> uh, oh shit. That's what? <laughs> oh, I can't anymore. Can't. Oh man. <laughs> uh, incredible. Yeah, we technically want the drill right now, so there might be a way to do it in a different order to end on drill that's better. <laughs> uh, ah! Where are we going, Weege? Wait, where are we going? I guess we'll do floating high jump. The <laughs> stream says it tempts. We're gonna snag the checkpoints and then try to do the skip here. In some world, we might skip that tank line, but I don't have it figured out yet. I wanna actually activate the platform ASAP. I forget about that sometimes. And then after this one, we're gonna try to just skip all this. Good enough. Good enough. <laughs> jet run overworld, yeah. <laughs> it was like jet run, jet run overworld moment. It's just because I don't know where to go in world six. Yeah. I'm not good at it yet. Uh, Cat's life. Thank you the three months since I'm so glad I found you. Love science creeper. Oh, I appreciate that, Cats. Thank you. See, I don't remember where I even go here. I think it's here. Where the Roomba's rule. But I might go to the left there. Actually, maybe I'm supposed to go to the left there. Dang it, I think I am. Alright. There's a better strat here at the start, but I don't remember it. Uh, let's do... Do I need that 10 coin? I don't know. I'm gonna try skipping that 10 coin and see how much it punishes us. Uh, let's get the secret exit first. Whoops. Whoops! Whoops! <laughs> there we go. It was almost epic. You did not like the floating high jump because it was so hard to not anticipate the Yoshi clutter. Oh, you can play with Yoshi? I would love to see a Yoshi speedrun. Alright, we're gonna come back to this level in a second. Sorry to hear about your allergies, Red Yoshi. 
I kind of have some too. This level can be done really well. It's not going to be by me right now. I'm just gonna get this. That was okay. Man, we might still be okay. We're kind of okay. Yeah, we're okay. Nice. I'll take it. That's, as far as that level goes, that was fine. Uh, do you watch baseball? No, not since I was a kid. If I read flutter, I have the Yoshi flutter. Oh, so you thought it was a Yoshi flutter. I see what you're saying. There. I know, the bumpers are obnoxious. I can't believe Nintendo made something worse than the Mario Maker bumpers. Like, what were they doing? What were they doing? Whoops, that was not right. Okay, yeah, we're skipping that 10 and we'll see how it goes. We still need four more 10s. That was pretty fast. Bounce on that guy. Oh, I didn't quite go far enough over here. Dang it. We can get that much faster with a better bounce. I should jump over that. I always forget. Whoops. Oh yeah, you can just die walking into that. <laughs> okay, I love the voice change is always the best in this level. It's always the best. <laughs> Woo! Amazing. Yeah, this is the best level for flower dialogue. Uh, Voids me, thank you so much for the sub. It's much appreciated. Do I need to break is on the left of the floating high jump. Okay, yeah, I think it's just left from here, if I'm correct. Watching the speedrun is really fun, considering the only wonder content you've seen are two parts in your YouTube. Uh, thank you, Voids. Welcome, welcome. So yeah, I think I needed to break this. Whoopsie doopsie. And then we're still gonna need to get uh, 33 more flower coins in order to shop but that's no problem let's go This time we go to the right. Okay, and I want to change my power up here. Do I remember how to do that quickly? I think that's good. All right, we should be able to make first cycle now. That was a good section. Yeah, there's first. That was easy first cycle. Cool, let's go. No. Nice. That was really good. We're schmoo- No! Oh, jet run moment! <laughs> We're schmoovin' and then jet run happens. Still don't know the fastest red through here. I just kind of wing it and hope that it works. 
Oh, I think it would have been possible to beat that cycle on this guy. Yeah, it's possible to beat that cycle. Have to look into that next. Love the music in this section. It's spooky. Good movement there. And I can just hold right. Super doesn't cost any time. You really like Luigi U? These blocks on a global timer? Yeah, I think uh, they are on a global timer. It seems like any block on rails is on a global timer, like the one in Condarts as well. So the faster you do the previous part of the level, the better, or that you could like optimize your cycle there based on that, which is pretty neat. Um, I can't afford this. So we have to do that later. Whoops. Um, yeah. Go left here. And I, oh, I can go right for grappling vine too. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's see what we can do here. We want to run off the snag that one. Do a bubble here for this one. And we're good on coins, so I can ignore the coins now. Oh my god, I need to scratch. <laughs> Not like this. I don't exactly remember the movement here, so get ready for spaghetti. Oh, that was actually good so far. Oh! That was actually good! Let's go! Let's go! Wow! Let's see if we can. This part's pretty cool when you do it well. Let's see if we do it well. Pretty good. Oh, I shouldn't have, shouldn't have uh, swam right there. And then it would have been really clean. Pretty good. Oh no, I jumped too soon. Oh, that feel when. Speaking of allergies, <laughs> you need to itch your face. Oh my god. Jet run is so hype. Yeah, jet run is hype. Mm, oh yeah, okay, let's not give away everything here. JK, let's go! YOLO! Climb! Alright, nice. I got stuck. I always get stuck right there. That was a pretty good pull. That was a good level. Um, uh, do you have a, each bubble jump maxed out, maxed, or uh, mapped out? Yes, I do. Jet run plus bubble jump is the sickest thing ever. It's such a good combo. Jet run does the horizontal and bubble does the vertical. Yeah, oh, she's right. Oh. But it is certainly the superior and cooler run. That's right. <laughs> Scale of 1 to 10, 9 out of 10, maybe 10 out of 10. Honestly, it's really good. Like, if I want to nitpick, I'd like more boss variety. But, like, the Bowser Jr. fight coming up is pretty cool, too. So. I don't know how to do this fast, but... We're going for it anyway. And that wasn't it. That wasn't it. But we'll take it. That was fine. I also wish I had more boss party, but I do like they managed to do some creative things with the junior fight. I agree, Hiles. I never cared for bosses in platformer games. I I said that until the the battle in fight in Celeste. <laughs> That's a cool fight. Uh, all right, we're good now. We just go by Celeste Chapter Six. Yeah, exactly. That's how you do a freaking platforming boss fight, right? 
Probably the best one I've ever seen in any game. I don't know which thing we're supposed to go to here. Maybe it's item park. All right, this level has scary strats. We're gonna try it. Hey, Dr. Snap. I gotta remember to do some bubbles to... Pot stress for good luck. <laughs> Pot has blessed the run. Uh, backup bubble just in case. Oh, let's go! Let's go! First try, easy. That was close. <laughs> we cut that close. Let's go. We cut that way too close. Zimbo, do you stay high up here? I don't like... Oh, I should have gone for it. I don't know what to do on this fight. I just flail around. Yo, Sam, I'll do it after the run. Actually, that'll be fun after the run. You stay far away. I just worry he's gonna, he's gonna just jump at me at any moment and I'm gonna get wrecked. How isn't he out of his form yet? There we go. I'm scared! See, look at that shit! Wait, that's not the right one. Where am I? Oh, uh, I'll switch next level. Because I get hit again. Alright, let's go. Why are you stealing from Bowser Tavers? Thank you so much for the 53 months. Oh, he jumps up when he's close to you? Can you control it? Is that what you mean to suggest there? Uh, the reason we lost some time there is because I realized I did Mama uh, in a different order. If you go over him, you might try to jump. Gotcha, gotcha. Excuse me, Bowser Jr., you are not Pom Pom. <laughs> and if you have to cross, you go high, super high up. I see. That makes sense. Sometimes I feel like he corners me and I just gotta go. Who is Bowser Jr.'s mother? Peach, clearly. Oh no. Ooh, we have... I think we spaghetti the shit out of Knuckle Fest last time. No, did we? Maybe we didn't, actually. I can't remember. You sent me a video on Discord. Okay, how? Knuckle Fest. I like this final world quite a lot. We're doing great, Scorn. Uh, really, the only thing that was bad about this run was World 2. Everything else was pretty minor. World 2 was a catastrophe, but I was thinking of resetting, so.
Oh, I always forget there's more dialogue. I love the missile mags. Bubble time. Good first pipe. I want to do a late bubble here. Two bubbles. One bubble's fine. Don't even need to bubble here. Uh-oh. <laughs> no! It's got to be a late jump if you don't bubble. That sucks. I wonder if it's faster to... Uh... Almost had the strat right. Slightly off. Just doing a bunch of coyote jumps in this level is the play, because you kind of got to do one right there to avoid that enemy. May as well just do one anyway. Well, you don't need a bubble there, I just... Uh... Gotta do the coyote time. Voltage. I wonder if uh, <laughs> it'd be fun to to do a legit speed run in a GDQ again. Doesn't GDQ have late submissions? I wonder if anyone will submit wonder. Yeah, so this level I used to hate and I love it. Let's see if we can do it well. Okay, we didn't bonk. Oh, we bonked. Nuts. Gotta slow down just a little bit here. Only a little. And now we're gonna go for the double bubble strat here. Double bubble. Two small bonks. But otherwise, good level. The next level has tons of cool strats, and I haven't feel I haven't fully decided what I want to do on it yet. Bye bye. All right. I'm getting hungry. I like Knuckle Fest. I'm just pretty sloppy on the very end of it. Don't have it fully figured out yet. Alright. Good start. Oh, I meant to hit that guy with that bubble. Would have allowed us to go a little faster. We're gonna throw a bubble off to the side there, and then I gotta pay attention here. Oh, I missed that one, sadly. Oh, man, that happens every time. <laughs> I keep missing that one. You can collect these things early with uh, some well-timed bubbles. Little spaghetti. <laughs> but not too bad. Hmm. How bad is it? I guess we're gonna. Knuckle Fest is actually gonna be a bit of a mess. Because I don't have a back. I should have snagged a backup power up just because it makes Knuckle Fest better. But I guess we'll go Elephant Strats. The problem with Elephant Strats is I don't know. There's one jump I don't know very well with Elephant. We're just gonna have to try to do it. Here we go. 
We're gonna do a needless strat at the start, but I think it's swag. Hell yeah. Take damage on purpose here, and then we're gonna swap. Normally I would swap to bubble, but since we are bubbleless, we're gonna have to employ our elephant strats here. Oh, we still made it. That bonk scared me. That bonk is so, so rough at the end there. That was good. Yeah, that's my PB. So here is the part that I don't fully, <laughs> I have a strat. Let's see how it goes. My strat is to rub this box which sort of sets the next cycle up a bit. Oh, where is my other platform? There's another platform right there, man. Where was it? All right, that was fine. That was more than we could hope for. This is what a cool part. Hey, yeah. Nice. Pretty good, all things considered. And now, I think that beating this with the elephant is actually important because you can do a, I think, four second time save on final boss uh, using elephant. But I haven't fully looked into it yet. I've only barely started to learn the final boss fight. There's some really cool strats for it, though. The elephant has a bigger hitbox, is what the elephant does in Bowser. So we do swap to boosting spin jump here. I always forget to skip the cuts. <laughs> Love the elephant so much. It's faster to use this because you can get early hits on Bowser. All Bowser wanted to do was have an epic rave. Yeah. <laughs> I love this Yoshi dragon thing. Okay, I got hit here last time jumping into these birds. Never again. Whoa, that sounded so crazy. Wee. 
Don't pull a Zimbo and die here. Shouldn't go down there. I love the Boo Opera. Yeah, it's great. Was that you, Zimbo? I think it was. I fell under this pipe. <laughs> Somebody I was watching good. <laughs> uh, it was. Oh, I love these worms so much. The little pipe worms. I want these in Mario Maker. Hey! What? Is it because I'm on the wall? Weird. I think it's because I was touching the wall or something. That was weird. Anyway, the elephant can hit Bowser immediately, so that's why the elephant's good. Now we're gonna go for... We're gonna go for the hot double hit. Or I guess the early hit, more like it. Hey! <laughs> I should stop doing that! <laughs> it really, it feels like you get stuck in the uh, ground pound animation longer than normal on this level. No, I actually need to lose the, uh, I need to lose the elephant. Okay, once on the left. Whoops. No! <laughs> Let me in! Oh man, I didn't get far enough over. Damn. So you can uh, hit that immediately. But yeah, I actually did need to get hit. Uh-oh. Or we'll die, that's fine. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh! <laughs> I've played this boss fight like three times in my entire life. I just need to do it more. Yeah, because I should have been over there on the side and then I would have been able to get this early too. So that's where the my knowledge of it ends, unfortunately. Gotta practice this more too. Now I think it's the left side after this. Hopefully we don't die before then. Yeah, I know how to do the double hits. I just uh, got distracted. And then spaghettied everywhere. Stop it! <laughs> Stop pushing down. Uh, now I want to be on the. Oh, I wanted to already be on the left side. Yeah, we missed a little. Only a little slow there. I want to break that. I should have been on the left side for both of those ending hits. It would have been faster. Not bad. Um, but yeah, we gotta learn. Let's see, we gotta learn Final Bowser. Uh, a bit of World 6 routing. 
Muncher Fields and Countdown. 10th place, let's go. That's 10th place on the leaderboard, I'll take it. Oh. It had played just before you beat it. Ah, Twitch. It's unfortunately hard to plan. Uh, Tavra 6 again for the 53 months. They say, why are you stealing from Bowser? <laughs> Not too shabby. Thanks for the GG's, y'all. What a fun game. Now let's time, next time let's not lose. <laughs> what's funny is it looks like I lost um, two minutes in World 2, but what's amazing is I had already lost a minute in World 2 in my previous run, so I actually lost three minutes in World 2. <laughs> so we have, oh, three minutes of time save in World 2. Mm. Yeah, I was countdown. Oh, the better Twitch extension lets the ads run in a um, pop-up. That's cool, Firefly. And also, um, I recommend uh, just downloading an ad blocker if any of them work. Stuck on mobile, ugh, yeah. What I'll try to do is watch for the, I can push a snooze ad button. I didn't think to look for it because I was focused, but I could probably hit it during like the cutscene if something like that happens again. Mm. I feel like I shouldn't upload this run to YouTube because the beginning is so bad. <laughs> Yo, Red! Thank you for the hundred dollar donation. They say GG's on the PB. Can't wait to see more Terraria content. I've been watching you for years and I you love everything. Yo, all right, so um, I will be editing um, our original Terraria playthrough for YouTube. We've already got four, four of them up, but um, I'm just gonna edit the rest. If anybody's interested in watching a completely blind first playthrough of uh, Minecraft on hardcore mode, Terraria on hardcore mode or Subnautica on hardcore mode. I have them on my Carl Playin' 42 channel. Or if you aren't um, aware also, I have all sorts of Mario shenanigans on the Carl, the regular Carl YouTube. Current record is 212 by Adrilic. Link is in the chat if you want to check it out. Thanks again, Red. I really appreciate that. But yeah, we're also playing through um, a Calamity mod or a, a Terraria mod called Calamity. Um, on the hardest difficulty called Infernum. It's really, really fun. It's a really fun playthrough. I got absolutely sidetracked by the uh, by this game coming out and getting addicted to the speedrun. Um, but sometime soon, probably definitely by this weekend, we will be returning to Calamity Infernum. No editor. Yeah, no editor. I'm just gonna do it myself. Yeah, Firefly. That one I can't. I, people weren't as interested in that one, so I can't really justify streaming it. I just watched the ending myself. It was awesome. Check, I recommend checking it out. Hiya! All right, what do we need to practice? I'll do some Bowser practice off stream, probably. Oh, we'll do Grab Pool World Three. Look at this shit. For anybody who's a, a Barb enjoyer here, <laughs> this was for, uh, Barb talking to me about Grab Pool World Three. So. Uh, now it's personal. This is just Bar's way of getting me to play Grand Pool World 3. But, uh. Um. Are there things you want to do but can't because you think Stream YouTube will want to enjoy watching? Yeah, Tangerine Cat. So, um, streaming is. Like, I am extremely grateful for streaming. I am the professor that I work with. I normally had a science job. The professor that I work with retired, kind of ran out of money. So I am extremely grateful for streaming in YouTube because it allows me to continue to exist and do things that I love doing. 
Um, I've even funded some of my science experiments with um, with some crowdfunding on on, on on Twitch and YouTube. But some of the drawbacks of streaming um, are like sometimes there'll be something that you really want to do and it just doesn't work on stream. Like it would, there are people and you, you know you can see it happen. Like who will basically kill their stream doing something they love, which sucks. Um, so there's like another way that it sucks too. And that is that if you don't want to do something, but your stream really wants you to do it. So like anytime there's an interest mismatch there, it kind of sucks because if you stream something that you don't actually enjoy, then it's not going to be a good stream anyway. Like it's just, you're not going to have fun doing it. Um, so the like holy grail of streaming is when you love doing something and your stream loves watching that thing. And so Minecraft um, and Terraria were both examples of that for me. Like I just freaking loved the game and everybody liked watching them too. So it worked out really well. But yeah, it does suck when you really want to stream something. I'm trying to think of any examples. Fortunately, there haven't been a lot for me lately. Um, the sequel of Subnautica wasn't very well received on stream, so I kind of had to stop playing it. Um, but other than that, I can't think of anything else. I was like, man, I really love this game and the stream just hated it. A lot of streamers got burned out on Mario, yeah. Yoshi's Island is the Holy Grail. You would love watching the practice grind. I actually um, wish that I had streamed more practice. I just kind of went down a rabbit hole with it. <laughs> but I, I should have streamed more practice for this game. I'll try to do that uh, going forward so people are more aware of what the heck I'm actually doing. Um, but yeah, sometimes also I just need to not sit down all day. Um, let's do a run through of countdown just to, just for vengeance more than anything else. Let's just, let's just do a really nice run of countdown for vengeance. Let's get a bubble power up. You can play Switch while standing. I, <laughs> I do have a standing desk, but like I have so many cords, the cords have to be able to stretch to the standing mode and it's like a complete mess. I really hope we get a Mario Maker 3. I'm definitely not like expecting it to happen though. Oh, that was so close. Whew. Whoops, I would have bounced if I had just waited a second. Can you make that? No, I wonder if it's... Is there a way to make that? I don't think so. 